Bayero University Kano played host to the Minister of Education who was in the state to commission some development projects in the Faculty of Education. The projects are the Center for Teaching and Learning, Micro-Teaching Laboratory, Department of Anatomy, Faculty of Veterinary Medicine, Center for Reading and Research and Development. He applauds the university on its developmental projects. It underscores the diligence and prudence with which the management of this university is handling uh, its funds for which they must be commended. And then secondly, we are also really very happy about the purposes of the facilities, not just having the building, but the reason behind them. While inspecting the solar energy projects provided for the university by the federal government in 2019, the minister, who is unhappy with the failure of the project, vowed to go after the contractors. We will bring the might of the federal government to ensure that people are here to account on this. Other projects were also commissioned by the Deputy President of the Senate. Even though government funds public universities, but there's nowhere on earth that any public funded university is able to have the fund, funds it needs fully from the government. So every public funded university must look inwards. Vice Chancellor Sagir Abbas notes that the university is committed to excellence and is ranked the fifth best university in the country. UK, in terms of ranking, as far as uh, academic activities are concerned, Bayero University today is number five university in Nigeria. Uh, we are coming after four universities that are located in one section of the country. So technically speaking, BOK is leading in five geopolitical zones of Nigeria. The federal government is keen on ensuring that all aspects of education translates to development of the country. From Kano Commercial City, Nanchin Vincent, Channels Television News.